we have the technology that allow us to be data driven and to be evidence driven but on the other side i think the key challenge for me and the thing that keeps me awake a little bit at night is the extent to which the institutions do not commit themselves to using data and using evidence in their decision making we produce and use data to really understand and measure the extent to which ifad has made a difference on the ground as well as knowing as to where it did not make much of a difference this overall commitment is something that I'd like to see reflected in the overall donor community and especially for agencies and organizations that are committing themselves to making a difference in the ground it's really important to understand that a food system includes not just the production agents or the farmers but it also includes everyone who's in the value chain and helping to market and to process and to deliver food as well as non-food items now this becomes challenging for many governments because governments make decisions uh, through ministries that tend to be very siloed so it becomes really important for international and multilateral organizations such as ifa to broker those relationships and to ensure that there is a dialogue that goes across ministries transformation means there is a disruption that we are essentially overhauling the way that we are thinking about food systems we want to see transformation basically with respect to the responsibility that every agent multilateral and international organizations the private sector people on the ground really take on with respect to how we consume food and how we deliver food we use the word transformation too easily and i think we've got to define it with respect to again data the important thing about data should be that it is representative because anything else is a story is an anecdote but when data is systematic when it is representative then helps us to understand and to measure food systems and what we cannot measure we cannot treasure